Alright, we're gonna start with Season of Harvest. Season of Harvest. To win, you must have a total of 2,500 skeletons in all your armies within three months. Some border guards can only be passed if a hero carries a quest artifact from a previous scenario. But the artifact beyond the border guard will travel with you to the next scenario. We have found a perfect area along Arathia's border in which we can harvest enough creatures for our armies without attracting much notice from the Arathian military. Build an army, but be quick. We need those troops immediately. Vampire's Cowl, Necromancy Amplifier, or Unearth Graves. We'll start with the Cowl. And begin. Before we begin our large-scale invasion of Erathia, we must fill our ranks. Erathia's populace will provide the recruits we need. Invade the local region and resurrect the needed troops. Yeah, obviously we should be using the undead. <laughs> the, the cursed temple. To truly catch Erathia by surprise, we must attack within three months. However, our forces are not nearly strong enough for a full-scale attack. We need you to harvest the creatures along the Arathian border, raising enough undead to allow, us to, to allow us to launch our campaign. As before, you must move quickly. We must have the element of surprise when we invade when we attack Arathius. We cannot delay more than three months. In that time, you must provide us with at least 2,500 skeletons. If you fail, we will have no chance against Arathia. Do not fail. And to do that task, we have Raquel. Good old Raquel. Now you will be seeing a familiar face in this scenario. Oh, Galthran. Oh, single stack come out. Of all the Galthrans we could have had. Single stack Galthor. Come on. Do we like that game? Oh, I need the mage guilds. Whoops. Alright. Well. Here you go. Yeah, exactly. We just need 20 good vampire lords. <laughs> Skeletons, psh, vampire lords. Silly, silly necros. They just didn't know. Didn't have the technology. The technology wasn't there. Exactly what we lost. All right. Good losses. Good losses. Damn game! I don't want to go over until I have the upgrade. Up, 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 up. Get back there. One of your advisors approaches. We have just learned that Sandro and his army are being held prisoner in this area. If you can find him and free him, he will aid us in our quest. 
I would hope so, considering this is Sandra's plan. Dun, 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 dun. Yes, we can. <laughs> Soon. Soon. Spoilers. Hey, it told us it was in the scenario, okay? Two hundred and three skeletons, soon to be even more. Dun 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 Hey XQ Comer, welcome to the stream. Do I know about any books written in the universe? Uh not in this one now. Can't buy, buy the boat. Dun, 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 dun. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I forgot to get the arties. And there's some good old <laughs> three-player manual. Hey, Skeleton King. Yes, here we go. Hey, Georgie. Welcome to the stream. All right, we're starting to file in. Now, let the season of harvest begin. Lots of pikemen, lots of skeletons. It's easy, man. It's possible. Probably not, X Cucumber. Probably not. Um, when I finished my stream last night, I fell asleep. I didn't even, I still haven't even, um, what's my call it? I still haven't even highlighted the last VODs, to be perfectly honest. A town. Oh, I know what to do, Skeleton King, don't worry, I know what we're doing here. I'll, I should definitely get to it after the stream today. Thorn. And Vampire Lords. <laughs> Thank you. The only unfortunate thing is we'll have to take a lot of these fights because the game somehow loses units and... Oh, 
Why am I bringing the Black Knights? Just in case. And why not? It's not like I want another army coming out here. And capital. Alright, first aid. Strike it, Bathia. That shouldn't... I'm sorry, that shouldn't be possible. <laughs> should not be able to solo armies with this... These vampire killers. Feeling the power, alright. That's that much is for sure. There we go. Oh boy, the circuit of counterpoise. I'm gonna make such use of that. Badge of Courage. You know, I had like five of them in the last campaign. First aid, we did it. Praise the eternal fire. <laughs> Basic eagle eye, alright. It just gets better and better. First aid on the undead, that's why they start with the uh, first aid tent, you know. Look at that, look at that, one point of damage. Boom. You don't see gains like that every day. No, no, no. Thirty-nine points of damage. Yeah. 
perfect account. Hey, Jezai, welcome to the stream. One more fight. Go, 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 go. want to feel a knuckle sandwich? Vampire Lords. They are very funny and very broken. Now we can go to the library. Alright, so let's see. 37 on him and 560 on her. That's, uh, you know, it's... it's only about 1900 to go. Alright, we're on our way. Um, I found that they're only shooting the vampire lords instead of the skeletons if I in those other fights if I was moving the vampire lords all the way. Otherwise they weren't doing it. They still shot the skeletons there, but for a while it was working. <laughs> Thought we had it down. Do it! No! Oh. That's a bit more than I was anticipating. My vampire alerts! No! For shame, you only got back 10 yet. No! Alright, alright, we saved them, we saved them. Now we can win this, we can win this. It's just gonna hurt a lot, apparently. This is why we brought the Black Knights. Like I said, just in case.
We're getting them all back, don't worry. <laughs> it worked! It actually worked! <laughs> we did a more city! Vampire Lords, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Vampire Lords. <laughs> Why? So broken. <laughs> I mean, I figured it would work, I just... <laughs> figuring it and then watching it happen is great. Yeah, working as intended. Had it all, had it the whole time. Also, hello, Echo Gamer. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> it worked. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Vampire Lord Toby. Ballistics. Yeah, that'll help for these non-sieges. Alright, so we have some fantastic skills here. I think that fight would have made me take proud. Or at least the resurrection of the Vampire Lords would have made me kick proud. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> All right. Them nagas bend the knee. Oh no. I mean, <laughs> I'll admit, <laughs> I didn't think it would go that well. <laughs> oh, whoops, wrong side. But it worked! <laughs> this is Long Live the King. Uh, yeah, one of the last. It's in the second tier of Unlockable. Uh, campaigns from Restoration of Arathia. Our game, you gotta stop losing uh, skellies in these easy fights. Makes me cry every time. Liberation. Nope, we did Liberation last night. We finished it at like 3 in the morning. And I was exhausted. Of the king, the other one that unlocks with liberation. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, this fight has proven anything. 
that 10 vampire lords are greater than however many units were here. <laughs> How did it still lose units? Alright, so 10 Vampire Lords are greater than 110 Pikemen and 66 Archers. Pikemen do more damage than Archers at close range. Better. I knew that they did, but I was getting hits on both of them. I was more focused on hitting both of them during the fight than just one of them. Damn it, no Town Pool. Really hope for Town Pool. They could get more Vampires. <laughs> yeah, I knew that, Rose. It was all a matter of, since the Vampire Lords were hitting the Pikemen on the Retaliation, I could hit the Archers vampires and then be whittling both stacks down rather than just one at a time three skellies died like pigs three skellies died like dummies yeah i don't know how the ai managed to lose three skeletons there but all right oh, hey best Well, greater than neck. No, they didn't, Pudic. We just aren't able to do them as much because of obviously the marathon here and you guys going back to school. As soon as Heroes 3 Athon ends and the schedules get screwed up again, we have plenty of time. Here we go, we're almost there. Just make the turns quicker. <laughs> I can't. I just, I never gets old. Press D much faster. Ah, it's fine. I was doing. We, we got it done anyway. <laughs> Alright, we've already got our Legion of Skellies. of skellies. Much faster. Alright, let's, uh, let's keep this uh, train rolling. Let's, get, let's keep it going. Yeah, let's get it. Heaven, could you uh, actually uh, whisper me that link to the clip? I kind of want to keep that. That was that was an amazing fun. How do I quick buy all the units like that? It's a feature of the HD mod where if you actually click on the town. Click on the town symbol, it brings up how much they would all cost, and then you can just do that. Ran out of ideas, all monsters are pikemen. Oh, there are centaurs up here. Once you got up there, there's a bunch of centaurs. I came down here for the pikemen because they're slower. Thank you. 
one of many cool things about the HD map. Counterpoise for three attack skill! Alright, we actually had that. The other guy still wants the badge of courage, though. Check the HD command, so my. It's kind of about loyal viewers. Lol. I mean, it's, I feel it's easier just to say to go look it up on Google. Thank you, by the way, for the, for the link, Lost Heaven. I do appreciate that. That's gonna be hilarious to watch. That's, that one was definitely a keeper. <laughs> Names of them are quite quite hilarious. Thank you, Twitch. Just 46 more. Oh, here we go, here we go. I think we're about to rescue him. Yes! Yes! We have arrived. We want the spirit of oppression. Here we go! Pack of liches, join! Vampires, join! And Raquel is about to go free! Sandro! There he is! There he is! It's Sandro! He has been freed from his prison! He's coming! Yes, he's here! It's... <laughs> it's... Alright, Sandro, your job... Just to go back and upgrade that army. Yes, the Lich King is back. You will tear this world asunder. He already is. This is his backup plan, too. This isn't even the original plan. See, here are some centaurs. Receive a letter from your superiors. Your initial progress is good, but you only have three weeks left to complete your task. Really? Oh, yeah, 1500 there. <laughs> Might as well, fast haste and quick combat. And.
go! <laughs> 652. Combined with 150 more. Gives me... 800. Plus 15. Alright, so we only need about 200 more skeletons. This will not be difficult. Dragons turned into skeletons. Yes, they did. I'm not gonna take the. I'm not gonna take the fights anymore. You guys have seen enough of how they go. We don't need that many more. And now it's Syndrome's turn with 98 vampire lords. And there it is. You have over 2,500 skeletons in your armies. Your enemies have no choice but to bow down before your power. And Sandra wins again.